Hey guys, and welcome back to the shop. In lieu of going for a ride in some snowy, icy weather, we've got a shop project to knock out today. Putting a battery tender on the GSXR 600. Done. All right, for real, let's get into it. The way I like to go about removing the gas tank side panels is to push in and pull this front tab out. I like to pull that tab out first. That lets me work up to the Velcro. Once you get the Velcro pop, that gets you back here to your rubber grommet. Get you a little bit better pressure on it, and it'll pop right up. Now that we have access to the seat bolts, we'll take them out using a five millimeter hex key. And then we lift up on the front of the seat and she's off. A lot of times you'll see these routed just through this compartment right here, dangling in the back. But because I know that we're gonna want room for our USB converter to plug in also, I'm actually gonna route ours through right here, down next to the frame inside the fairing. That'll leave room for our converter and a cable to come out and make a safe loop without any chance of kinking up your USB cable and damaging that. Now we have our cables routed through. We're zip tied to the pillion pad release cable, routed down beside the frame and crossing right here behind this hump. You can see the two spots where the bumpers from the seat sit. And I have verified that this cable will not be pinched in any way. It'll have room to move right there. So no dangers there. Let's test this thing out and make sure it works before we reassemble. And we'll test it out on our battery pack here. There we go. We've got juice. For reassembly, we'll start by putting the seat back on. Put the two side panels for the gas tank back on. And then snap our pillion back into place. And that is how to install a battery tender in less than five minutes. As always, stay safe, stay sane, and we'll catch you next time. Mm.